Lizzie Yarnold insists she will relish the honour of leading Great Britain out at the opening ceremony of the Winter Olympics on Friday despite the predicted plunging temperatures in Pyeongchang. The defending Olympic champion will become the second British skeleton athlete to lead Great Britain out at a Winter Games after Shelley Rudman performed the role in Vancouver in 2010. The 29-year-old who graduated from the University of Gloucestershire with a degree in BSc Geography and Sport and Exercise Sciences, was selected by her GB team mates for the honour when the 23rd Games open in South Korea on Friday, the 9th of February. Yarnold and the rest of the 59-strong GB team will be equipped with special down-insulated jackets. With a temperature threshold of minus 40 degrees, as well as salopettes and fleece lined beanie hats. Yarnold said, I am hugely honored to be flag bearer. I have been flag bearer in a closing ceremony in Sochi and that was really cool. But that was a celebration of an amazing games. I've got to make sure I stand tall and represent GB. It's something I'm used to doing sliding on the competitive field but in a ceremonial moment it's really exciting and something I never thought would happen. We have loads of thick layers and massive jackets and as Winter Olympic athletes we always go out with salopettes and gloves so I'm not concerned about the cold, it's good to come here and have freezing cold ice. Quote, Yarnold who also carried the flag at the closing ceremony in Sochi, is relishing her role as a comparative underdog going into her second games after a relatively unimpressive World Cup season. Fourth place in the final race of the regular campaign in Konig C last month set her back in the right direction after a series in which she often found herself finishing behind Great Britain. Teammate Laura Dees Yarnold added, some athletes thrive in big moments and I am one of those. But it is quite nice to be the underdog sometimes. And to come into the Olympics after an up and down World Cup season. Quote, 